So today we are going to be doing cardboard painting. This is an example that I made earlier today. I used paper for this one, but I'm going to use canvas this time. You can use whatever sort of paper or canvas you have around your house. This does get a little bit messy, so I put down some newspaper to just protect my surface from the paint. I am going to use acrylic, but you can also use whatever other paint you have. I think anything will work. Um, and then you don't need any paintbrushes. All you need is a piece of cardboard. Okay. So first step is to just put some paint on your canvas. Try to make sure you have enough so that when you rub the cardboard over it, it'll actually spread it out a little bit. Use multiple different colors. I'm going to use some yellow, a little bit of blue, making sure I have plenty of paint so that when I spread the cardboard over it, it will spread out. I'm going to add some white. Maybe. Okay, if it's not perfect, some more blue. And I think I'm gonna finish mine out with just a little bit of silver. Oop, maybe a lot of silver. Okay, so once you have your paint down, you're gonna take your piece of cardboard and you're just gonna spread it. I found that it works better to hold closer to the bottom of the cardboard instead of up high, because then you don't have any bending. So then you can just move your cardboard along. And you can stop as you go and kind of change the direction you're going in. Make a fun pattern. off the edge. You can see I now have lots of paint on my cardboard so now I can kind of use the same piece of cardboard and just really wiggle it around to make some more fun designs on the top. I found that to be kind of really fun. If I'm not liking the yellow as much I can kind of wipe the yellow off and use more blue and just kind of use your cardboard and see what you can make. all sorts of different designs. I might paint a little bit, spread around on the edge of my canvas a little bit. Got some blue just kind of hanging out over here I can use. This is why we have a some newspaper down on my table because it does get a little messy. Making designs and if I want a little bit more dark blue in there I think I could use some a little bit more paint up a little higher all right so now I'm going to Wipe off my hands a little bit and then add a little bit more paint. This time I think I'm going to make my line. Let's see, we'll just have it follow down like that. You can change the order that your colors are. Looks like the exact same color. Okay, now I can use the other side of my cardboard to do the process again. I 
find it fun to move the cardboard really quickly because it gives it some cool design. I'm gonna paint my edges. cardboard but I'm just gonna wipe off one of my ends for my next strip. Make sure that when you do this, you don't wear any clothes that you don't want to get paint on because it is a little bit messy. As you can see. Alright, so I'm going to take my cardboard and do it over again. any white spots that I might have. Some of the paint that's just now on my newspaper. cardboard painting. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day and you enjoy this activity.